The man chased a speeding car desperately, just as he was about to get in. A warning that energy was about to run out suddenly popped up. Because the man was not human but a robot, the energy orb that belonged to him was in the car he was chasing. The vehicle drove all the way into a campus. The robot tried to break in to retrieve his core, but was stopped by a sharp-eyed security guard. He had to step back and find another way, but just as he was about to climb over the wall, he was caught red-handed by the same security guard again. Despite repeated setbacks, the robot still refused to give up the chase, but his energy had dropped to the danger line. He had to go to a nearby electric electric vehicle exhibition store first. The store manager mistakenly thought the man had come to buy a car, greeted him enthusiastically and invited him into the store. But the robot's eyes were fixed on the fully charged cars. He immediately walked towards a car, but at the moment his hand touched the door, he collapsed to the ground because of power failure. The store manager thought he was lying on the ground to study the car's chassis, and praised him for observing carefully before buying, then helped the man into the car and continued to introduce the configuration. But the robot quietly took out the charging cable at this time, plugged it directly into the car's charging port. As energy port into his body, his power recovered a little, but the store manager misunderstood that he was experiencing the seat comfort, and continued to introduce the car's selling points. The robot nodded symbolically. At this moment, the store manager found that the car was out of power. The store manager looked confused, suspecting that the employees had forgotten to charge the car. The robot quickly pulled out the cable and pretended nothing had happened. In order not to lose this customer, the store manager took him to see the next display car. As soon as the robot walked over, he immediately found the charging port and charged himself again. Soon, this car was also drained of power. Power. What happened next was completely out of control. The man drained all the energy of the electric cars in the entire exhibition hall. When his energy rushed back to full, the robot jumped up gently and left. On his way out, the man met the boy who had taken his energy orb. He wanted to get the energy orb back, but the boy asked the robot to pretend to be his father, and promised to return it to him after the school event. When they arrived at the school, the father of the boy's classmate made a three-point shot, then mocked the man for not knowing how to shoot. But the man threw the basketball casually. It fell into the basket on the other side of the court, not even touching the rim. Seeing this, the boy pushed over a cart of basketballs. The man kept tossing the basketballs into the air. Every basketball went into the hoop accurately. The boy announced loudly that his father was the best. The classmate's father blushed with shame on the spot. Next was the tug of war and dumpling feeding competition. The man and the classmate's father were in the same team. The man easily fed the dumplings to the boy, but the classmate's father couldn't pull him at all. Finally, it was the sprint race. The classmate's father ran to the front. The boy didn't want to be outdone, urged the man to speed up quickly, but the man suddenly picked up the boy, ran to the front under the shocked eyes of the classmates. The boy crossed the finish line like a superhero, finally won the championship successfully. I'm Flash Movie, see you next time.